No one made a theme song for me. Do I have to do all the work around here? Seriously? Ah, I guess I'll just have to have the intro with no sound. It will be silent. Like the cave that is my heart. Ooh, I just got an idea. Hello everyone, I am Rico the Puppet, and this is the Rico the Puppet Show, now in high definition. This is not high definition, but everything is in high definition. And this is the Rico the Puppet Show, brought to you in standard definition. This is not even standard definition. Well, how am I going to be popular if I can't keep up with all this technology stuff? Yeah, so this is the Rico the Puppet Show in substandard definition because definition is too mainstream. You can't define me. And I'm just going to totally Instagram this look because color is overrated. And when you put things in sepia tones, it totally makes it look artistic. And it's badly framed. But that's intentional, to make it seem like I know about cinematography. I'm going for a Kubrick-esque look. But you wouldn't understand, because it's really artistic. You're probably thinking, hey, he's just wearing those sunglasses to try to look like a hipster by ironically wearing them because he actually hates them. Well, guess what? You're totally wrong. Totally wrong. Totally wrong. Because I actually really like these sunglasses and I'm wearing them because I'm taking advantage of, of the movement of wearing things ironically to wear stuff I really want to wear but people would normally mock me for wearing them and so I keep you at a comfortable distance while thinking I'm cool and you're stupid but you wouldn't get it because you're mainstream yeah so why don't you go back to watching your American idols and your eating food like all the other people. Well, it's time to look at the comments. Even though I don't really care what you have to say because you're stupid or something. Yeah, I'm so cool. I don't even have to look at the camera anymore. I'm just, I'm taking a new artistic direction that you wouldn't understand. Oh wait, can't really look at the comments this way. Well, I'm just going to turn this way only because I have to. But I'm not part of your system, peoples. I'm my own person. Okay, well, let's see. Nothing. Not, not one comment. Well, that's fine. Doesn't hurt me. Because comments are lame anyways. Oh! Who am I kidding? I can't be ironically ironic. I'm just hurt. And, and confused. I'm done with being ironically a hipster! Yeah, get this scarf off of me! Ah! Alright, I'm done with being an ironic hipster. But I do want to keep the sunglasses. I like them! Is that okay, hipsters? For me to like something for real? Really reals? Is that okay, hipsters? If I genuinely like something? I do look pretty hot. Oh yeah. Moving right along. It's time for Slave to Be! You know, I watched the Hunger Games movie, and there's some controversy surrounding it, and I am in full agreement with the protest. That's right. I agree with the protesters of the movie so much, I pulled out an old-timey term to properly invoke how much I agree. Can someone please explain to me how the Hunger Games can get away with a movie without even a mention of Hungry Hungry Hippos, the first and foremost name in games about being hungry. I got to the theater to, excited to see a movie about my favorite childhood game and it turns out it's about kids fighting to the death over Lady Gaga's costuming? I'm assuming that's what you win? Because everybody had those weird costumes. Anyways, instead of killing each other, why aren't they playing Hungry Hungry Hippos to resolve who wins the sparkly makeup? I was so disappointed in the Hunger Games movie. I'm giving it zero stars out of four Hungry Hippos. Disgraceful. It's like making a new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie 
And then taking out the Teenage Mutant part. You're telling me the next Ninja Turtles movie is taking out the Teenage Mutant part? What are they now? Like turtles from the pet store that get ninja training? But, because it would be pointless. Because they're just tiny little turtles. They're not mutants. How are they going to hold their weapons? They'd be all slow and everything. Eating all the bad guys' lettuce. That's not very threatening. Well, that's today's show. To wrap up, perhaps you're looking for more fun time puppet videos. You should check these guys out. I'll, I'll put a, like a link, like floating into the air, like right here, through the magic of technology, or regular magic. I'm not sure how they do it. Anyways, remember to like and subscribe and comment and send various meringued pies to this video. It helps me get more noticed and feed me more pies. Also, I'm endeavoring to make sure I post a new video every two weeks. I would do it more often, but I'm trying to catch up on all the YouTube videos I've missed in the past five years. Well, see you next time.